Hey guys, what's up? Goldieville now one here. Today I will show you how to broadcast decent quality music over Ventura Low. And I'm gonna try to make this video as short as possible, but it will take at least five minutes. So please be patient and go along with me. First off, you'll need Ventrilo. And I'm not gonna show you how to get Ventrilo because you should probably have it by now. The next thing you'll need to know is how to create a second Ventrilo tab. To do this, right click on your Ventrilo shortcut on your desktop, go to properties, and put a dash M after the last quote. So it should look like this. Space the last quote after exe and put a dash M right over here. After you do that, you should be able to open two control tabs. I will not do that yet. Next, you'll need Winamp, preferably the latest version, which is this one right over here. It has fixed a lot of the bugs on the previous versions, and it is pretty much the same thing, so yeah. Next thing you'll need is Virtual Audio Cable, any version, but it has to be the full, or the trial message will interfere with your broadcasting. So... Here's the torrent link to get the full version of Virtual Audio Cable 4.0.1. I'm not going to show you how to torrent for the sake of this video getting removed. I'm just going to give you the torrent link and hopefully you'll know how to torrent if you just go to google.com. And I'll give you the link to Winamp too in the description. After you have successfully installed Virtual Audio Cable and Winamp, Virtual Audio Cable should not have any tabs or like windows or whatever on the desktop it's just so line one for both playback and recording tabs under your sound management you're gonna go enable them make line one default communication and line one for recording default communication and don't worry about no sound you'll still have sound of Ventrilo and hopefully your PC if you did it correctly but unfortunately you will not be able to chat on other places like Skype or Steam Chat because your default communication device is line 1 but under Ventrilo you could still select which way you want to use it so that's why Ventrilo still works and finally you will need music media on your PC, .wav, .mp3 files etc and a decent patience to listen to everything I'm about to tell you so first off you're gonna open two Ventrilo tabs here's the first one and the second one's gonna be right over here. Alright, don't come in with both of your names because that's just bad. Just create a new username under here and select it. And make a binding for it to mute and unmute microphone bind. I'm gonna show you that right now. I'm gonna make a new one. Just name it whatever you want. And add a key and put on toggle mute microphone and put it any key you want it doesn't really matter so here's the binding to, mu to mute and unmute your stream select it mute the sound for your mic spam tab and open the stuff up connect to the server from both ends and go to a music channel if your ventral server has one for the sake of not getting banned so after you do this, go to settings for your virtual mic spamming tab and make sure virtual I mean virtual audio cables installed correctly and line one is enabled for both playback and recording with the full communication set. Put line one on output, input, and mixer and it should look like this. Also disable push to talk and put silence on 0 0.5 and set heavy on zero. And don't worry about people complaining, you can easily turn off the music by pressing your bind to mute the stream. The codec doesn't really matter, it should automatically select the best one for your computer. Turn off play key clicks and put events on all nothing so there's no sound on your virtual tab. And yeah, this is basically it. You could take another look at it before I close the tab. And here it is. Test your mute and unmute bind to see if it works correctly and it does so everything's basically set now you open Winamp and you're almost done go to the main menu button on the top left corner go to options preferences and press configure on either no soft direct sound or no soft wave out wave out has better volume and quality for me so I'm just gonna use this one click on configure and under device select line one virtual audio cable press ok and close and this should be your new uh, default set one so don't worry about changing it every time you're about the mic spam and yeah 
Now simply select any song you want from your imported music from iTunes or whatever else you got your music from. And if you did it all correctly, it should work. And yes, it does work. Unfortunately, I forgot to uh, record record my stuff, so you won't be able to hear the uh, music playing. But trust me, let's review this video again, and if you do everything correctly, it should work. So I hope this helped you guys. See you later.